At the start of 2023, I, I went to film camp. I don't know why, but I was so scared to go. I think it was because I didn't know who was gonna be there and who I would be meeting and how many people there was. Turns out there was like 70, around 70 people that went and it was the best experience of my life. And I think the one thing that I learned from camp and just, just the idea of going to camp, I learned that you should just do things for the heck of it anyway, even if you don't feel too comfortable. Yeah, that was the biggest, that was the biggest thing I learned. The Lonely Hearts Film Camp is something that uh, I'm pretty sure it ran twice. And it essentially, it's all wedding photographers and videographers trying to up their game in video. Um, and you've got 70 people from around the country and you've got about five speakers from around the world. Um, these guys are the best in their field. They're the absolute bomb at what they do. Grace and Andrew are just incredibly amazing people that they were able to make this happen, not once, but twice. I wrote these questions for me, but if there's anyone out there that went to camp that wants to ask themselves the same questions, I encourage you to do so. Um, it'd be cool to see your response to the same questions. How did you feel before camp? Um, I felt really nervous. I was really nervous. I, I used to be a very introverted kid and I guess before going into the, any of the wedding industry or anything, I was, I would just talk to and see my friends and it was just like a few friends. There was, yeah, I wasn't, I didn't like really going to parties. I could deal with going to parties and I was trying to push myself in that direction and get out of my comfort zone. But I was very introverted and I just would not go to any parties. And so for me to go to film camp, I was like, oh, like I didn't even go to like school camps and things. Um, I went to one, but I was really young, but the other ones I didn't really go to. So yeah, I, I felt nervous. I felt very nervous about going, um, mainly because I didn't know what was gonna happen or who was gonna be there. I was kind of scared. But at the same time, I knew it was gonna be really beneficial to me because I had seen the videos from before and I knew how amazing it was going to be. And yeah, the connections I made at camp were lifelong friends. And I think that it was definitely worth going. So um, yeah, I was nervous. I was nervous before camp. <laughs> what did you love the most about camp? I loved just the family connection that was there. Like everyone felt really, really connected and we were just kind of synced. Because you get a bunch of creatives in one spot, it's just this really good energy. And I think that's almost what it might be like on particular film sets. It's just because the crew is so intertwined with what they're doing, they're just like a family. Um, like you see like family run restaurants, I guess that's how I felt at camp and that was, that was the thing I loved the most, that family connection that I felt like I had found a family um, that I never knew I had. So yeah, <laughs> that was that. Who did you learn the most from at camp? Ricardo. Ricardo I learned the most from because I was able to not only expand on my skills and understand that there's different ways of shooting, but also I got, I got to soul search a bit and I think that's really beneficial and that's carried me out through the whole year, I guess. He just felt like a dad man. Like he felt like a father. Um, he was just really kind and genuine and he was amazing. Ricardo Fasoli, check his, check his channel out. Um, he's, he does some pretty good YouTube videos as well about um, his filmmaking and stuff. So yeah, um, Ricardo. Ricardo was the one I connected most with. Cross and expressing himself. And I'll just pivot down. What was the most interesting thing being said? Oof. To me, the most interesting thing that was being said was there's so many different ways to shoot a film and everyone is so individual and that was really interesting to me and 
I guess I hadn't really been exposed to lots of different types of ways to do something and especially when it comes to filmmaking and editing and um, the minds of, of all the creatives there at camp was just everyone was just so individual and every film that we saw kind of fit with who they are as a person and I love that I love that there was such a diverse sort of creative community there so yeah that was the most interesting thing I thought about that a lot after camp <laughs> how did I feel after camp going into camp I felt like there was very little knowledge like just the raw basics and coming out of camp I was just my mind was blown and I was kind of just I was so motivated on my creative path because I was in the middle of some projects New Restro Amor was one that I was working on. I know that I wanted to create a story, but going into camp, I was like, oh, I gotta come out of camp and I've gotta make this project. And I, I really, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, but I came out of camp and I was like, I've got so many ideas for this film. And that carried on to projects that I took on later. And some people that I met there, Jake and Sabrina and, and Dids, we ended up going to New Zealand a few months after that <laughs> to shoot a film. And we all met at camp and so it's after camp I just I felt yeah I felt like my my world to creativity was expanded and the possibilities were limitless in a way because you know before I felt so limited to what I could do it's like ah oh, we can either do this or this and after camp I was like we could do this this or this um, or even this and I was just yeah I was really motivated and Creatively, I think it's gonna, it's gonna keep me going throughout my whole life, throughout my whole career, because coming out the other side, it was just, even just a few days, I just came out so refreshed. Like, I felt like my soul was touched, <laughs> in a way. Um, I activated my inner chi, I guess. That's, that's how I felt, so, yeah. Yet again, thank you, Grace and Andrew. Thank you so much. Um, you guys are incredible and you guys, you guys are the bomb and I love you so much. Um, and yeah, go check out the Lonely Hearts Film Camp page. <laughs>